welcome to the Ameridroid Minilab slash Electrical Closet. Today we'll be looking at an upcoming project we'll be showing, and that is how to create an Odroid C1 Plus battery power tablet like this one. 7 inch touch screen. This particular one is running Android, but of course you could run Linux as well. And uh, so we'll take a quick look at the features. First of all, we have a screen on off switch here. We also have another switch. This switch will turn the Odroid C1 Plus off completely. We've estimated that with this battery pack, which is the UPS2 for the C1, you'll get about two and a half hours in the on-demand setting on the CPU governor uh, with the screen on, or about somewhere around four hours with the screen off. So that's that's decent. Of course, we can add more battery. There's plenty of room inside for more stuff if you look at it. So here we have the uh, Odroid C1 Plus, and it's using the HDMI and micro USB connectors to send information to the screen. This big cable here is the power cable running to the UPS2 right there. And um, the UPS2 has the 3000 milliamp hour battery on it. As you can see we've got plenty of room in there. We are using a, a small uh, USB cable dongle so that we can have a Wi-Fi module 3 in the system. As you can see there, the Odroid Wi-Fi Module 3. Tuck it back in there. A uh, future enhancement will be to desolder the barrel connector and power the C1 directly through the GPIO header, so we won't have to have this cable here. But yeah, the on-off switch is nice to have. The charging port is also on the outside right here which will allow you to recharge the battery and also run the tablet while it's plugged in. And uh, a nice feature is to be able to turn the screen off when you're not using it. But uh, yeah, it's a pretty cool little tablet. Lots of expandability, a lot of possibilities and options to do with it. All right, that's it for today.